The next from Jared Smith. Subject is Bret Hart Heat with D. Malenko. What's up, crew? Hope everyone is well. In Bret Hart's book, My Real Life in the Cartoon World of Wrestling, he completely destroyed D. Malenko by calling him a pint-sized wrestler whose work was too rehearsed. He, wow. He also blamed Dean for entering his groin in their match by botching a standing suplex and not apologizing for it. Watching the match, I couldn't see where Dean was at fault, but do you guys agree with Brett? Also, if you guys had problems working with Dean, thanks as always. I never had a problem with Dean. I never had a problem with Dean. That's kind of weird. Pint-sized wrestling. He's a, yeah, he's a pro's yeah. pro, man. Yeah. N- nobody had problems with Dean. He was as professional as I don't. I, I think Brett might be the first guy that's ever had a problem with Dean that I know yeah. of. Yeah, I've never heard that before. That's bizarre. And I'm, I'm assuming, knowing Dean, and we both know him, that he didn't know Brett was hurt. If he knew right. Brett was hurt, he would have gone over there. So Absolutely. I just think this is Brett getting really hot, and I love Brett too because, you know, I'm, but I don't know. Who knows? Maybe it was just a Brett problem at that time, Disco, because you've referenced having problems in your match with him and stuff like that, and that was around that same time too. You know, Maybe mm-hmm. it was just a difficult time for Brett. Yo, what up? This is Conan, and I host Keeping It 100 with my co-host, Disco Inferno, unfortunately. Well, I'd say you're my co-host. Listen, every Thursday here on Spreaker, we talk pro wrestling, sports, movies, music, TV, pop culture, and some politics. It's everything the rest of the pro wrestling podcasts are not. Tune in to hear myself, the superior one, educate and inform. Tune in to hear me bury Disco. That's very disrespectful. Join us every Thursday on Spreaker and keep it 100. Boom!